This ain't Sly Cooper. Adam, Jamie doesn't know what that is. I was gonna say, is that a reference? Yeah. What is it? Explain. It's a video game. What kind? He's a fox, I think. That's cute. <laughs> I don't know if he's a fox. Is it supposed to be? No, cute? no, no, he's a raccoon. Oh, yeah, because I said that we were raccoon detectives. Uh. Oh, and I guess is, is that what he does? I um, haven't played it. I just know what he looks like. Adam, elaborate. No. Tell us about Adam, Sly. do not tell me about Sly Cooper. <laughs> I, I, I will literally create issues if you... <laughs> like what? I will cause problems on purpose. Stop if you... causing problems on purpose. I'm threatening. Ca- I will cause problems on purpose if you freaking tell me about Sly I really Cooper like right that... That verbiage. I'm in the. I didn't even realize I had to go into the graveyard at night. Ooh, <laughs> spooky. Y'all scared <laughs> yet? Oh my god. Excuse moi. Bats? Let's go. I'll say nothing. <laughs> yeah. Listen. I, I want no problems, he said. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going to a haunted house. I don't have time to learn about Sly Cooper. I know he's a wreck. Oh, sh- Ooh, cutscene. <gasps> Hello? <laughs> of course, it's a dark and stormy night. Naturally. I don't oh, what was that? I don't know. Something fell from the tree. It looked like a body. Oh, yes, there it is! Oh, it is. Oh, oh. <laughs> that was so scary. Are we about to see a bunch of them? Is that like... Oh, oh, oh. Woman, there was a woman. Find Cardi! Ah, oh. <laughs> okay, that's a, that's the... That that's just definitely thing. fake. Okay. Oh, Nancy's all scared. Girl, me too. One of the Hardys was calling me. Uh, answer. Okay, answer. Yeah, who is it? Frank. Frank. Nancy, you sound excited. <laughs> yeah, well, guess where I am right now. Haunted forest. Uh, wouldn't even begin to. Salem, Massachusetts. Joe. Joe. I love you, Joe. How the heck did you guys know? We read about the Hathorne house in the globe. Suspect is arson. Your name was mentioned. What? Ooh. Not as a suspect, obviously. <laughs> Tegan Perry mentioned she had hired you to investigate. Hired? Huh. That's news to me. I came here as a favor for Deirdre. Deirdre Shannon? Wow. That's yeah, we get it. We agree. Yeah. It's a strange case all around. This four has been making sounds. Mm-hmm. Are you guys in Boston? I'm like standing in the middle of the haunted woods, like after having my heart ripped out. Right, because we saw a woman hanging from a tree. Well, multiple. We're this case, and a few legal questions have arisen. My Ooh. father would probably be more helpful than me, guys. Yeah, well, we prefer to call you because of, you know, history. What my brother is trying to say is that there are some similarities to an old case we worked on. Sure. If you want to send me your notes. I can look them over for you. Great. That's great. Salem's pretty close to Boston. If you guys have the time, you should yeah. come up here and check it out while I'm in town. Really? Yeah. It would be good to catch yes. up. The Hardy Boys are coming. Uh, I don't know, Nancy. With our special detective powers, we might be mistaken for witches. Heard they don't care well up there. For, Joe, shut the heck up. I love Joe. Me? They love you guys. <laughs> you know that Salem is the only police force that has a witch as an official emblem? Hmm. I don't think that's true. A hey, cab, Nancy. I'll bet you on it. Okay, you're on. I'll take payment when we arrive in Salem. Maybe in a week or so. A week? Hopefully I won't be here then. But if you can make it up earlier, great. Good talking to you, Nancy. <laughs> right, I'm like, can we get off yeah, the phone now? Nancy, We're in a haunted forest. Yeah, that scared me. Empty. I know, but it scared me. Sorry, okay, guys. this guy is absolutely horrifying. Can is I, that it? Can I take its paddle? It's cheat. Brother. I don't like that. <laughs> I do not vibe with this. Can I take your hat off? This ghost be like, I got a rock. <laughs> I saw a woman hanging from There a was tree. also a woman standing right before Frank called us. I don't like there that. There were multiple women hanging. I think, I Y'all think good? Gone. Were we dreaming? What was that? Go up. Look up. Look up? Yeah. Okay, yeah, because I thought it was here, but no. Maybe she honestly was just, like, looking at stuff through scared eyes. Katink? Katink. <laughs> Girl! <Yeah, it's> right. <laughs> that was rude. <laughs> Nancy, who's never scared. Hmm? 
Why is she just like? I didn't mean to click. I thought it would click it faster, like it did last time. Okay, dear Janet. Oh, May isn't talking. Did you say something to her? Nothing in particular. This forest is giving me the chills. I can't believe you're actually going out there. And if you see a ghost, don't let it take your soul. Okay, Deirdre. You know what? I think Deirdre, in her own believing in ghosts sort of way, uh, is looking out for us. I know. She was like checking Deirdre in. Deirdre Redemption sure. Arc. I. That's what this whole game feels like a little bit. Deirdre Redemption Arc. Yeah, which is fun. You know what we haven't seen? Hang on. Ooh, cutscene. Are y'all scared yet? You should be. I'm horrified. <laughs> <laughs> That's no good. Why <laughs> do you like me? <laughs> That's no good. I'm gonna <laughs> fucking deck you. I'm gonna punch you in the nose. <laughs> Why are you being so mean to me? Because Andrew's not here to tell me not to bully you. Yeah, when did he go? Yeah. I knew you'd be scared out of him. Hey, walk right in. Who even cares, Nancy? She goes, oh, light came on mysteriously? Let me just waltz on. Waltz on inside. What are you doing here? Oh, girl. Okay, she's definitely the girl from the picture. Yeah. You're trespassing. This is private property. Hey, Lauren. So, nice to meet you. I like her hair. I like her hair, too. Give me one chance. Okay, let's pick the right dialogue option. <laughs> um, I'm an investigator? Because Maybe. that would give me lawful reason to be here. Let's try it. And then she'd be like... I get I get, okay, let's do it. I'm an investigator. <laughs> um I'm a friend of May Perry's. What? You're lying to me. I'm not lying to you. May doesn't have any friends, except Tegan. So you're either May's friend or you're an investigator. But you're not both. Oh, okay. So what are you? <laughs> Oops, <laughs> Olivia's too late. Because I feel like Olivia's tour. Like, people have probably gone on it and would know it doesn't take you here. I feel like we should just be forthcoming and be like, you're right. <laughs> There's a lag in the chat, Adam. So you're hearing us and seeing our decisions I just a hair I you don't after. know May as well as you think. Maybe. I'm fine either way. I don't think the game will end. I know her a lot better than you do. Okay, that doesn't mean you know her well. Well, you're not leaving, are you? No, we're okay, not. so we got it. It worked, yeah. <laughs> so, hi. I know this is awkward. My name I is like your sweater. Drew. I like your plants. What do you want, Nancy Drew? Well, I wanted to talk to you about... <laughs> about the Hathorn House. Sit down. You drink tea? Yeah, I love yes, tea. Yes, of course. I didn't mean to lie to you, Lauren. Yes, you did. You wanted to talk to me by any means. I like I her. I didn't lie to you. I'm an investigator. <laughs> So, what do you want to know? I think she's more so talking about how when we said you're a friend, we're a friend of May. That's I how she consider knew. myself a friend of oh, May. Oh, yeah, you consider yourself a friend of May. I still don't even think Nancy considers herself a friend of, of May. Can I start? Well, that's. I think that's saying goodbye. So let's let's just start from the top and work down. Luminous Infusions, your shop? Yes. What do you do there? Just curious. It's a tea room. And modern apothecary. I love it. You know, I want to go. Before there was a pharmacist, the town relied on an herbalist to provide medicines for headaches and sickness and energy and stuff like that. Interesting. Did Francis Tuttle teach you this? No. I taught myself. What is this motion? Oh, cool. It's like she's sticking her hand in her hair, but badly. I think she's just being spooky and... Dreamy. What can you tell me about the history of the Hathorn House? Sorry, I'll move it. I'll move it. <laughs> Judge John Hathorn in 1695. The man flat out stole the land from the people he sentenced to death. Property has changed hands many times over the years, with Francis Tuttle being the most recent owner. This is now an ASMR channel. <laughs> I was. You should have got me one while you stood up. Thank you. We have cookies. <laughs> Homemade. I'm just elaborating really so everyone can be appropriately jealous. Are you done with your questions yet? No. <laughs> I'm like, probably what don't even you know. Ago? <laughs> I've been called a question machine. The house was burned a week ago. Well, actually, there's something else I'm looking into as well. I've almost had enough of your questions. Have you looked for the will? 
Of course, but I can't find it. Believe me, I've tried to find it. And now the judge is giving me days to deliver or the town will take control. I don't have a copy, but I know one exists. Francis told me all the time that the Hathorn house and its grounds would be mine if something ever happened to her. She knew that I would take care of this place better than anyone else. happens to you i won't be here anymore but i have representation is it the only lawyer in the town i bet it's the only lawyer in the town <laughs> her name's alicia cole yep i appreciate the two women of color in this game yeah i was just thinking that i like how they're i was like she has to be the woman from the photo you know why because <laughs> she's the only fucking black woman we've run into yeah look lauren I apologize for approaching you like I did. It was wrong, and I should have known better. That's right, Nancy. I appreciate you being straight with me. I'm sorry, I've been a little angry. I've been dealing with a lot lately. I don't think Lauren killed Francis Tuttle anymore. No. If, <laughs> if she had been a little bit not this, yeah, she's kind of cool. The Scarecrow? Yeah, I've heard there were ghosts out here. But all I saw was that. Do you believe in ghosts? Nancy does not. Nancy's gonna be like, nope. I've seen a lot of weird things. So far, I've yet to find one without a rational explanation. Then there's nothing you talk about. <laughs> but why does everyone think there are ghosts out here? A town this old is bound to have some unbelievable stories. So you've seen one? You don't live here. You wouldn't understand. I think that's valid. I think it's valid too. I'm getting a little tired. I think we've talked enough, don't you? <laughs> of course. Thanks for your time. Can I search through that old house? Hey, do you mind if I search through that old house? Don't mind if I go to that room where the yeah. Okay. Is it? <gasps> oh, ghosts! Whoever is doing this, you're not frightening me away. Girl, look at the ghost. You're driving me insane. Okay. Okay. Not possible. That's not possible. Nice. Ooh, she's gonna be closer. Hang on. Shh. Curse not the darkness. <laughs> it's not real. It's not real. Oh. And then we died. <laughs> <laughs> That's the end of when the When she turned to the side. Oh. Okay. What's going it. on? You weren't answering your phone. Yeah, girl. You will not. What's wrong? You look like you've seen a ghost. Her. I guess it could have been him too. It was too confusing to really make out. What are you talking about? The ghost, Deirdre. The ghost at Hathorn House. The one you were talking about. I saw it. Wow. Never thought you'd try to pull a joke like No, dead ass Deirdre, Deirdre. we saw it. <laughs> you know Nancy's not funny. This is a really good performance. Very un Nancy Drew like. It's not a joke. Deirdre, I saw her. Didn't you want me to see it? Didn't you want me to look into it? Well, yeah, but I didn't think for a second that you would. I guess I thought you'd go up there and find smoke and mirrors or whatever it is you do. You're saying it's real? don't know what I'm saying. Yeah. I'm not used to being so freaked out. Wait, you didn't leave my car out there, did you? Girl, no. Did what? we? No. no. How did we okay. get back here? Okay. Calm down enough to drive back. It's outside. She's like, thank God I don't want to go anywhere near it. I could get you more chowder. Aw, thank you, Georgia. Aww. I think it'll help. I need answers. Okay. So let's go through it. I do find working in this Tune in. Yeah, I was gonna say <laughs> that was okay, before we. Cool. I was say before we do dialogue, let's talk. <laughs> I, I, because it reminds me, because obviously you and I have played. Um, we ghost talked about it last Horton time. Hall, yeah. Hall. I love it when there's like an actual ghost in Nancy Drew games. Me too. The haunted ones, freaking best. They, I agree. I think anytime where I can like walk by a mirror and, and all of a see a ghost. Like, yes. yes. <laughs> Okay, okay. Oh, we also have so much in the little chat. <laughs> uh, no, I do. We don't have to read every single thing. Oh, but I want to talk. I want to answer the questions. 
Um, Cookies during a horror puzzle game. Yes. <laughs> Nancy Drew <laughs> Carey gun or any other weapon on her. No. God, that would be cool. I really wish that Nancy, Nancy had a fucking Drew Glock. Had a gun. <laughs> she used to have. Um, no, she's too. Um, in the book, sometimes she's got like a tire iron because she drives a convertible, mm-hmm, and she'll mm-hmm. just be like, "I'm just gonna carry the tire iron I'm into the say, haunted house." And sometimes, just to be like safe. in the games, you might pick up something that Crowbar she keeps in her inventory that could be used. Do you remember? Um, <laughs> you're just like any time, Nancy. <laughs> Do you remember in uh, the one that's in Paris with the designer? Yes, Danger by Design. Danger by Design, when you you can buy, like, uh, random items, and you can buy the Kung Fu book, yeah. the martial arts book, and then at the end of the game, you have to fight the villain with the martial arts from the book. <laughs> so there's that. Nancy herself is the deadly weapon. Yeah. She can learn martial arts from a book. Mm-hmm. <laughs> She's really cool. And I do think that it's a fair point to raise that we only saw the ghost after we drank the tea. Right. Oh, I didn't even see that. By our... Um, by Lauren, she's the herbalist. We saw it in the tea. woods. We definitely saw things. We saw in the woods. Some, we did saw things. We in the saw things woods. hanging. But we didn't from see the the half. I saw. I, did you ghost. see the one that was like on the path? It wasn't the same as. The, I didn't see the one that was on the. There path. There was one I standing, it. um, like by, near a tree that was like, it was next. We were standing next to that ghost scarecrow. If you were facing that way, there was a tree and there was a woman. And it was the same thing as the one hanging, but it was standing. No, I didn't. You didn't see, see that it. One. No. So I don't think it has to do with the tea. I think it has to do with that. There's a ghost. Because we, we saw it before. <laughs> yeah. I was like, the, the, See, the, the thing hanging scared that shit out. out of me. But the thing about um, ghosts in Ace of Two Games is, if you remember, the ghost of Thornton Hall, the explanation was that there was a there gas leak. Yes, that it was like but carbon monoxide. kind of a half-assed... Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? It's like, could have been a ghost. ghost but you know? it was also... Nan- but it has the thing for Nancy to be like, well... Well, it was a ghost. Yeah, like, you we know. were hallucinating. I'm trying to I think mean, the fact other that you would picture ghosts. a perfect figure of a Spectral woman figure, in like yeah. the same dress every time you know what i mean right it feels like too deliberate and i think they're more so relying on the fact that it's already in our mind that we're expecting to see yeah that, but the fact know? that it i don't know just the fact that you've pictured exactly identically the same every time but doing different things yeah you know what i mean it's like if i picture you and then i picture you again you might not be wearing the same outfit the second time i picture you know what i mean right, that's true. but it's the exact same dress down to the, all the detail anyway that's a different game entirely so yeah. anyway <laughs> but we're just talking so mostly the time or rather every time in nancy drew when there's a ghost there always there's ends an explanation up being an out so mm-hmm. i'm curious as to what if they're the gonna do that be. or if they're just gonna lean into the salem awesome. spookiness of it all i don't know what to tell you drew it's as weird as moon chunk cheese ice cream and sandals with socks but mm-hmm. my instinct is i really like her coat that the two are related the fire and the ghosts i don't have to right you're not buying Olivia's story that some coven of witches came here to unleash ghosts to take revenge by burning it down, though. Right? Right, I think. It's unlikely anyway. You really think what you saw was real? It's worse than that. I think in order to know, I have to see it again. And you need to come with me. Tomorrow. Hell yes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Bigfoot and aliens and the Loch Ness Monster. Okay, I would read that book. I would watch that okay. movie. I would, that's a great buddy cop film. I feel like Nancy and Deirdre could. You know what I mean? I, I want them to work together all the time. I, I would literally like, I'm, I, fuck Bessinger. I don't give a fuck up about Bessinger. <laughs> me and my Bess- homies hate Bessinger. <laughs> <laughs> me, me and my homies love Deirdre. Yes. Found out something interesting. Lauren what did we find out? Know that Francis Tuttle had a will. That Francis Tuttle had a will. Judge Danforth never mentioned that. Because they can't find it, they assume it doesn't exist. So if it does exist, Lauren would get the estate. Yeah. Oh, and that lawyer, Alicia Cole, represents her. We're gonna that talk working to out Alicia her, again. Mm-hmm. There doesn't seem to be much progress made. Yeah, well, without a will, what could she really do? Little pumpkin. <laughs> Little right. pumpkin. I think I'm just gonna call it a night. Night, night. All right. You do look kind of... <laughs> Damn, somehow you look ugly as hell. She's... Well, say the full thing again. It was like, damn, senpai, you look ugly as hell. What's wrong with you? <laughs> Is something wrong with you? Want that chowder now? The offer expired. We make a pretty good team. Deirdre Redemption See, arc. That's proof right there. Of what? We're definitely hallucinating. <laughs> cute. Shut up, Deirdre. Deirdre. I like them. Deirdre's I like them as little buddy detectives. I know, it's cute. Oh, I'm getting a call. Uh, Joe. Ooh. There's always an 
explanation. Gotta remember that. What is the town of Greenwich, New York? Sorry? They have a witch on their emblem. Oh no, we owe the money! Oh, what? Really? Sending you a pic. When can we expect payment? <laughs> That's a fire department logo. I said police. <laughs> Public safety. It's all the same. A technicality. It's not a technicality! There's something I have to get off my chest. I'm in love with you. I yeah. saw a ghost. <laughs> Sorry, what? This case. I've never seen anything like it. It's not real. I can't explain it. What is it? What's wrong? Hold on. This Day is gonna no be the more. thing that gets it's them so to come down. That ghost hunting is our specialty. Joe. <laughs> Wait, what? We're not passing on a chance like this. Yay! Yay! Only if you really want to. Talk to you later. More friends! Gang! We're getting the band back together! 